What's going on ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, welcome to today's installment of Renegades Reviews. I am the Renegade J.J. Williams, here to bring you my thoughts on yet another Halloween movie. <clears throat> Sticking with the family friendly theme here for a little bit, I'm going to review this motion picture from 1993, where after three centuries... The Witch Sisters are resurrected in Salem, Massachusetts on Halloween night, and it is up to two teenagers, a young girl, and an immortal cat to put an end to the witches' reign of terror once and for all. I'm talking about Disney's Hocus Pocus, which starred Bette Midler, Kathy Najimy, and Sarah Jessica Parker as the Sanderson Sisters as well as starring Omri Katz, Thora Birch, Vanessa Shaw, and Doug Jones, with uncredited cameos to Gary and Penny Marshall. This is the second year in a row that I have seen this movie. Believe it or not, I had never seen this movie prior to last year. It is a good movie, a cute movie, but it is not one of my must-watch Halloween movies. It is something that I happened to own and wanted to keep going on a bit of a family-friendly thing here, so I figured I'd throw it in. Um... I can recommend it as far as, like, it's a movie that you should see at least once. But for me, personally, it just doesn't warrant a lot of repeat viewings. I know a few, I have a few friends who love this movie, and this is on their must-watch list every year. I'm just not a huge fan. I do enjoy Bette Midler. I think she is a great, talented singer and a funny woman. I do enjoy Kathy Najimy. Um, we already talked about her and her brief appearance earlier this month in Bride of Chucky as the motel maid. Sarah Jessica Parker is pretty, but I have never really been a fan of hers personally. Maybe that right there is why I don't get in the movie so much. Because I've never been a big fan of hers. And Kathy and Jimmy, I can kind of take and leave. What do you guys think of Hocus Pocus? You know, is this a must-watch movie for you every year? Or is it something that you can just kind of cast off to the side for more of the traditional horror fare. Let me know. Leave your thoughts in the comment box below, as always. Let me know what other movies you want me to talk about on the road to Halloween as we finish up here. Let me know which Christmas movies you would like for me to discuss as we get ready to kick off our road to Christmas beginning November 1st. And until tomorrow here on the Casa D18 Studios channel, I am the renegade J.J. Williams, and I will talk to you guys all once again tomorrow.